sit back in a bit, meditate, I think I should. No, we ain't friends, got me on t What's going on guys, this is Bryce from Fitch Records and we're back with another video, another update on Logic, another update on the long-awaited, anticipated album of Vinyl Days. We got a lot of information. The rollout has officially began and I'm gonna go into all the details about that because there's a lot to get into. But before we do that, like, comment, subscribe. Check out my link tree down below. I also have my Twitter, my Spotify, and my TikTok down there if you wanna check out that. So I'd appreciate that. And you really might wanna follow my TikTok because I may have got the Logic Co sign over there last night, you know what I'm saying? I may have got that. I may have got a few comments, a few likes, you know what I'm saying? So if you're not tapped in, go down there and tap in. I'm posting short term content down there that is similar and different to what you see here. So do that. But vinyl days, we have a confirmed release window that I'm going to get into. I'm going to show a TikTok logic posted the other day. Uh, he also went into detail about all the issues he's having with Def Jam and there's a, a lot of things that are going on right now. So went on this rant about Def Jam and everything that's going on with them. And he actually had to post it twice because the first time the audio got muted again and I, I, he was not happy about that. I'm gonna play that TikTok for you guys now. Def Jam, why are you fucking up my releases, man? First of all, I love you, Tunji. Tunji's my guy. He ain't got nothing to do with this, okay? What the fuck is going on, man? I told Def Jam that I wanted to release my shit as a two pack and I just found out that they're releasing it as two singles at the same time. What kind of shit is that? On top of that, they telling me, Oh, don't don't drop your music video early, because if you do, you might upset our partners who feel like YouTube's getting an exclusive. I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. I care about my fans, man. I care about hip hop. I care about music. And I'm going to be honest. Years ago, I was playing that game. Don't do this. Release this on this shit. All for the bread and the money and trying to be fucking extra. And I don't give a fuck about none of that, man. I have my baby. I have my wife. I am blessed, bro. I made it. And now that I'm here at this place, I ain't taking nobody's shit. Def Jam, do not fuck up my release. Vinyl Days is coming out in June. I'm so excited. I love y'all, but they fucking my shit up. Everybody in that building who is really there for me, I love you. Thank you so much. Everybody else can eat a dick. Basically just talks about where he is right now, and he did say that Vinyl Days is dropping in June which means it's gonna drop on a Friday most likely. So we do know of the potential release dates of Vinyl Days. It's either gonna be June 3rd, June 10th, June 17th, or June 24th. One of those four dates, Vinyl Days will come out. So obviously uh, Logic's a little fed up with Def Jam. Nothing new, this has been happening for years and years and years and years and years. If you're a real fan, you're gonna know that, you're gonna remember that, even back in the day under pressure. Like, And clearly he can't wait to be independent, and I don't think either of us can, because that's just gonna be crazy. Uh, you know, hopefully we get albums and albums and albums and albums. You know, I know he just has them sitting in the vault, so if you're independent, you might as well. You might as well supply the fans a little bit, you know what I'm saying? But speaking of his problems with Def Jam, they actually said he could not drop the music video for Tetris, which was one of the songs that came out last night. Uh, so he was like, all right, I'll just upload it on TikTok. And eventually Def Jam did say it was fine and they could, but apparently they were trying to block it for some reason. And they were really trying to block it because they muted the audio for Tetris <laughs> when he posted it. He was like, I can't even post my own song. I don't really know how that works. I mean, I know uh, TikTok has like their copyright system, so I don't know if it was Def Jam's fault for real. Because I know I've posted like music on there before, and if it's more than like a few seconds, honestly, it'll just get like auto muted so I don't really know if that's what happened to him but regardless it's his own music I feel like if it's your own music I think social media is developed enough to make it so that you can go past those copyright laws considering it's your music <laughs> but you know regardless I'm sure it's frustrating for him clearly uh, he's upset he wanted decades to Tetris and come out as a two-pack and they did not they came out separately uh, they actually did drop a two-pack for it but the two-pack is only clean <laughs> There's not an explicit version, at least right now, as of me making this video. There, There's not an explicit version of the two-pack, so I don't know what they're doing. I don't know who's controlling his, his streaming platforms, who's uploading this, but they're not doing a good job. But, you know, eventually the Tetris music video did drop. It's hard. He's up in the Def Jam offices, jumping on tables. It's fucking great. And, of course, the songs Decades and Tetris did release. I'm not going to play any snippets for either of those songs because last time I did that all my videos got blocked and I had to mute the audio sections for it so we're just gonna live with what we got here so you just got to listen to that on your own uh, I'll link them down in the description if you want to listen to them on YouTube but they are fire uh, I'm gonna have to say Tetris might be my favorite of the two let me know which one you guys prefer more but Tetris just 
Tetris is just hard, dude. Tetris is Tetris is hard. Decades is cool too, though. Uh, a little underwhelming, you know. I'm not gonna lie, but uh, that verse, that ten year old verse he has in the middle of it, with with lines from the end from Welcome to Forever, pretty fire. Callbacks, you know, the OGs will get it. So to sum everything up, two songs from Vinyl Days are out. A music video from Vinyl Days is out, and we know the album is going to drop June 3rd, 10th, the 17th, or the 24th. So I'd say uh, we got a lot of good news. We're on right track. We're not in the dark anymore. You know, the rollout has officially begun. We can stop panicking. You know, there's a timeline for how this is going to go. And honestly, I'm really excited. I know June's a little bit far away, but, you know, Kendrick Lamar's kind of dropping in May, so I wouldn't be surprised if that had a motive in it, honestly. But, you know, we'll have to wait and see. But yeah, I appreciate you guys watching. Like I said, subscribe, hit the bell, follow my link tree with my TikTok, my Twitter, and my Spotify down below. Let me know if you like Decades or Tetris more in the comments down below. And yeah, it's been Bryce. Peace.